Another important safety topic is kickback, which is a serious hazard associated with grinders. Kickback is a sudden reaction to a pinched or snagged rotating wheel, backing pad, brush, or any other accessory. Pinching or snagging causes rapid stalling of the rotating accessory, which in turn causes an uncontrolled power tool to be forced in the direction opposite the accessory's rotation at the point of the binding. Kickback most frequently occurs when using cutoff wheels, but can also occur when grinding near corners or edges. You should know that kickback may happen when using any accessory on a grinder, so you must always be prepared. For example, if an abrasive wheel is snagged or pinched by the workpiece, the edge of the wheel that is entering into the pinch point can dig into the surface of the material, causing the wheel to climb out or kick out. The wheel may either jump toward or away from the operator, depending on the direction of the wheel's movement at the point of pinching. Abrasive wheels may also break under these conditions. To minimize the chance of kickback, always take the following precautions. Number one, maintain a firm grip on the power tool and position your body and arm to allow you to resist kickback forces. Kickback will propel the tool in a direction opposite to the wheel's movement at the point of snagging. Always use a side handle for maximum control over kickback or torque reaction during startup. An operator can control torque reactions or kickback forces if proper precautions are taken. Number two, use special care when working corners, sharp edges, etc. Corners and sharp edges have a tendency to snag the rotating accessory and cause loss of control or kickback. Avoid bouncing, which can also snag the accessory. Number three, do not attach a saw chain or wood carving or tooth saw blade. Such blades frequently create kickback and loss of control. Number four, never place your hand near the rotating accessory. The accessory may kick back over your hand. Angle grinders are versatile tools with many applications. One common use is in abrasive cutoff operations. When using an angle grinder in this capacity, always follow these safety cautions. Support panels or any oversized workpiece to minimize the risk of wheel pinching and kickback. Large workpieces tend to sag under their own weight. Supports must be placed under the workpiece near the line of the cut and near the edge of the workpiece on both sides of the wheel. Use extra caution when making a pocket cut into existing walls or other blind areas. The protruding wheel may cut gas or water pipes or electrical wiring or objects that can cause kickback. Do not jam the cutoff wheel or apply excessive pressure. Do not attempt to make a cut of excessive depth. Overstressing the wheel increases the loading and thus the susceptibility to twisting or binding of the wheel in the cut. This also increases the possibility of kickback or wheel breakage. Do not position your body in line with and behind the rotating wheel. When the wheel at the point of operation is moving away from your body, the possible kickback may propel the spinning wheel and the power tool directly at you. When the wheel is binding or when you are interrupting a cut for any reason, switch off the power tool and hold the power tool motionless until the wheel comes to a complete stop. Never attempt to remove the cutoff wheel from the cut while the wheel is in motion, otherwise kickback may occur. Investigate and take corrective action to eliminate the cause of wheel binding. Do not restart the cutting operation in the workpiece. Let the wheel reach full speed and carefully re-enter the cut. The wheel may bind, walk up, or kick back if the power tool is restarted in the workpiece. 